Today we uh today I'm showing you how to catch every single species at Lone Star. So obviously uh Lone Star Lake fish species they made it so you can catch like a little checklist basically about common trophy and they had this like a couple days ago and I'm gonna show you how to get a full checklist just like me. So first we are going to catch the bluegill and the trophy bluegill so let's go so first i'll show you how to catch normal bluegill and then i'll show you this insane sport to catch trophy bluegill which works instantly just like that that's very 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 easy um yeah sadly i did have to leave everglades i made a lot a lot of money i have that just a lot of money, I can't lie. So basically, all you'll need for this is red worms and hook a. Uh, don't really matter what rod you are using as long as it's a flow rod. Yeah, I'm just going to use my Omni Flow. Um, I'm not really too sure on how to, on like how to catch this bluegill, but like no matter where you catch, you're really going to catch bluegill, isn't it? Yeah. So let's just try and catch this bluegill and see what happens. Hmm, this looks like a bluegill. Tis a bluegill, let's go. Now, the trophy bluegill. This is where it gets very exciting because I'll catch this in like 30 seconds. So look, all you do is come over here with that at damn road. With red worms and you don't even have to change the hook. Cast over here. Hook eight and red worms. We should catch a trophy bluegill very easily let's see if we can catch the whole thing while i'm recording give it about 20 more seconds if it and fish them bit it then i'm gonna just turn this off and wait oh nibble 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 all fish. Trophy bluegill, let's go. I literally cast it about two seconds ago, I already got it. nibbles. Go on, take it. Nice. Back to Shiner. Oh my god, it works. Let's go. Look at that little fish in here. Go on, China, please. Let's go. Alright, now we got to do. Um, what do I, what do we catch next? Let's have a look. Red ear sunfish. I. So now, now instead of what we put on pet. So what you do is you come over here to Dam Road. You put on hook two. Pet food, and just cast that right here, and I'll see you guys when we catch one, which hopefully won't be too long. We got a fish on the Omni float, so shit. Ready some fish, let's go. So now to catch the trophy ready some fish, we just come over here, much like the blue gill spot. Go over here. Inventory on a hook A. I don't know why putting on smaller hooks work for getting trophies, it just does. Yeah, I'm gonna cast that right here and I shall see you when we get a bite. Fish on, decent size. And it's a red ear sunfish. Trophy red ear sunfish. That's it. So, what we do is we get, I might have to put a better bubble on this ship but what we do is we get hook four small minnows just put it on there i'm gonna quickly just change my bubble oh shit wrong one i'm just perfect don't i actually right, so go over here trophy be bubble that's better now now we go over here some for exploration and cast out and wait to get either a white crappie or a trophy white crappie we can catch both here with this same exact setup, so yeah, let's wait. I can see a little white crappie looking at my small minnow in the water, 
and it stroke it struck even not stroke oh and there's a trophy one now we just gotta cast back out and get a normal one yeah so let's go it's a good thing that the same spot for the trophy and the normal is the exact same spot but yeah let's go i can see what looks to be a fish well, no shit, it wouldn't be a fucking lion. But, yeah, it's going after my small minnow. Is it a white croaker? You can't really tell. And it looks to still be there. And it looks... Yeah. Let's go! Ooh, ah, let's go! Now we just have to catch the final four, and these are all the big fish that I've done how to videos on. But you know, it's just I can't leave them out when I'm doing all species at Lone Star for the checklist because some people might not have seen them. But yeah, we come right here, get your casting spoon run out, and you just I'm gonna use what you would normally have at this level a golden. Casting spin. Uh, it's like a hook one, maybe even a six ounce. But I'm using the third ounce because I don't have a six ounce. Probably sold it or something. Just for an extra buck. But yeah, all we got left is a spotted bass, grass pickerel, channel cat, and small buffalo. When you cast out, you either want to do stop a go, which is just um click and click and then go the R2 button over and over again, and you want to get to three white dots. Because weight is good. That was like the most race, racist, yeah, unracist thing in the world. Please do not take that out of context. But yeah, so didn't catch anything on this cast, I don't think. But you can also use another technique that is called um, twitching, which an easier way to do it is. Just hold L2 and do stop and go. But yeah, you might also have bass jigs and stuff and other casting spins. Use that. This fish literally just got on at the last, last second. I got it in like as soon as it was coming out of the water. It's like I couldn't, <laughs> you couldn't even see it. Just like literally it was about right there where I caught the fish. And I was still reading in for my twitching and it's boom out. So yeah, now we've got. So for grass pit crawl, we just go over here. Uh, this is yeah, this is a good grass pit crawl spot. Come over here. Turn either cast this way or this way. You should catch grass pit crawl. So yeah, see you guys in about not long. Hopefully, We've got a lovely little fish in the first cast, and this is a grass pit crawl. So now what we do is we come over here and go to uh, probably this one actually will be better. This one. Go over here. Why the fuck do I have mono on? That's three fucking pounds. What have oh my days I had the wrong fucking shit on the wrong rod. Mm, that's smart. Uh, yeah, that should be good. How much? How much weight is this? Nine. Six hundred. Yeah, that'll be fine, mate. Trophy blue bobber. Hook two, one. You can even catch even hook eight. Small cut bait or pet food. Let's go over here. The spotted bass spot is where you should catch them and uh you can catch them on your float rods and your f and on here so i'm gonna use hook one on this one and i'm gonna use it and i'm gonna use um pet food i'm just gonna cast that out here now you might catch some red some fish and get unlucky with it but if you're catching red some fish just change the small cut bait I have no clue what just happened. I think I'm stuck. No, well, I'm obviously not, but like. <laughs> well, I just put this rod out here like two seconds ago and it's already, already got a fucking fish on it. Oh, <laughs> Mate, I put this fish out 
And just looking at my new shoes I got, because I was taking a bit of a break, just going bass fishing, yeah. Not really taking anything serious. I literally just cast my rods back out. I thought, nah, I can't be bothered to put my Phoenix on. So I just put on Omni Float and just instantly got a fish. How good is that? And I did a challenge, Catfish Master 2. How good am I? I'm so good. Alright, catch more off buffalo, this is really easy. Come to a dam ridge. Even though it is the hardest fish to catch, in my opinion. Just come here. Put down your little rod stands. Put that there. Get on this phoenix. Not phoenix. Or where is it? Your feeder rod. Just get your feeder rods. Go in inventory. Put on hook one. Blah 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 blah. Here. Hook. I'm an idiot, I already put my hook on. And semolina balls or dough balls will work fine. And just cast that and you should get it easy. Alright, not too long ago we put this rod out. Maybe like two minutes ago. I already got a fish on. Oh, and it looks tough. Be as more buffalo nearly fucking broke the line then. See that shit? I was a bit close. It'll be the final fish that we need. This is a small buffalo. Yeah. And if you haven't seen these videos already, go look at the My Dad Buffalo if you want to see that. Where we caught an absolute monster fish. I say monster, I mean monster. Weighing in. Shit, I fucking went over it. Must have. When in that 12.983 pounds of dough balls, that's crazy. Just beating that is a dangerous thing. But yeah, go watch some of my other videos and see you in a bit.